The long division method for polynomial division will really only make sense if you know how to do long division. Now, it is unlikely that you were taught how to do long division at school. It's a bit of an archaic method. You were probably taught how to do um, the bus stop method, or short division, as um, it's called. So, for example, if you had to do um, uh, 474 divided by 2, Okay, the way that you were probably taught how to do that was 2's into 4 go twice, 2's into 7 go 3 times, remainder 1, and 2's into 14 go 7. So the answer is 237. That's the short division method, bus stop method. If you're going to do it long division way, this is how it works. You go 2's into 4 go twice, so precisely the same as we did with short division. Then you do two lots of the two. So you multiply whatever that number is by this number, and you get four. You then draw a line and make a subtraction. So four take away four is zero, and then you bring the seven down. Twos into seven go three, and then you say three times two is six, Draw a line, perform a subtraction. Bring the 4 down. 2's into 14 go 7. 7 lots of 2 is 14. Perform a subtraction, you get 0. And so there's 0 remainder. This is long division, okay? which you may or may not have seen before. It is precisely the same thing that's going on here. It's just we're doing the calculations in our head rather than having to write it all down. Okay? So, long division using polynomials uses pretty much the same method. Okay, so this is how it works. So we're going to have the x plus 2 uh, outside of the bus stop. And we've got x cubed plus 5x squared plus 16x plus 20 inside. So we go, we always working with this x. x into x cubed goes x squared. You then multiply the x squared by both of those terms, the whole thing. x squared times those two terms. So x squared times x is x cubed. x squared times 2 is 2x squared. You draw a line, you perform a subtraction. So you get 0. 5x squared take away 2x squared is 3x squared. And then you bring the next term down. It's working in exactly the same way with, as we did with the numbers. Then you just do x's into 3x squared. So that gets you 3x. 3x multiplies with the x plus 2 to make 3x squared. And 3x times 2 is 6x. Draw a line, perform a subtraction. 0 plus 10x. Bring the 20 down. And then x's into 10x go 10. 10 lots of x plus 2 is 10x plus 20. Draw a line, perform a subtraction. And so the answer appears above. OK? And that is long division using uh, sorry, this is long division polyno with polynomial division. Okay, so this is the way that I was originally taught how to do it. This is not the way that I that I do it now. However, I just use the grid method. But if you are happy with this method, then um, far be it from me to say otherwise. Okay, so you can continue working with that method if you like. If you were never very good at that method, uh, it's probably time that you take up the grid method.